Hey everybody, it's Christine. I just felt the need to share a quick video on an article that I just found on Facebook. Uh, if you've been following me for any time at all, you will know that I struggled with um, some issues in my previous relationship. Emotional and verbal abuse, which, you know, a lot of people don't really consider abuse because you're not physically harmed in any way. But I can attest to that fact that sometimes it is just as bad, if not worse, than physical abuse because things that are said to you, things that are done to you to scare you, to control you, to threaten you, can sometimes hurt and stay with you far longer than a scar from something physical can. And I'm not discounting physical abuse at all by any means, but I just am kind of making it my mission, I guess, in life to just raise awareness for all types of domestic violence. And I came across something absolutely amazing and super, super positive that uh, a moving company in California is doing. Uh, the company is called Meathead Movers. And it's a company that was started back in 2000, actually I think it was 1997, sorry, uh, by two brothers. And when they first started their business, they just worked for maybe 20 bucks and a pizza. Nothing major, but as the business grew, they started to get more popular because they always took really good care of the things that they moved and were very courteous to people. And they started receiving lots of phone calls from frantic women who were trying to leave domestic abuse and leave homes, apartments, whatever, before their abusers returned home from work. So what this company did just amazes me so much. I, I just wish there was something close to where I live. It would have been very helpful to have something like this in place the day that I finally took my kids and left that type of environment also. What they've done over the years as they've expanded, they have actually partnered with local women's shelters. So they make sure that on moving day, when they arrive to help these women, and I should, I should also note that this offer to move for free is good for both men and women because I do realize that there are men also who are victims of domestic violence. But anyway, what they do is work with local law enforcement, women's shelters, to make sure that uh, restraining orders are in place or police can be called, that somebody's there so that the movers as well as the woman or man and family who are trying to move are all kept safe. And I just, gosh, I, I saw this and I just started to cry. <laughs> because it really hits home with me. But my goal is to, now that I've seen this, you know I've often wondered how I can give back. And I think this is something that would definitely be worth looking into to start um, to try to help other women or men who are in the same situation as I was and to just let them know that there's a way and that people do care. And you really can start over and there are people who are willing to help you do that sorry this one was a little emotional <laughs> but um this one was from the heart today so anyway i am grateful that there are amazing people like meathead movers out there and the steed brothers and uh there, there's always someone that you can go to for help and i think it's super amazing that there are companies in place that are willing to step in and do whatever needs to be done to make sure that families and kids and women and even men do remain safe in situations like that when they take it upon themselves to get out and start a better life. So with that, have an amazing day and I will be back tomorrow. And remember, you are worth it. Bye, guys.